Welcome, my friends! Raise your pains! Welcome to the Vector Eyes! Guys, thanks so much. My name is Jonathan. I'm so sorry uh, for having, you know, the problem uh, earlier. I got, uh, you know, internet crash, but now I'm here, my friends. Thanks so much. Tell me if you guys can hear me well, okay? Please let me know if you can hear me. Let me see. Uh, okay, you guys can hear me well, all right? Okay, my friends, thank you. Let's see who is here. Hello, Ariadna, welcome. MSM, Tick, Vela Smith, Peter Das, Debbie Williamson, Daniel Bompton. Hello, Daniel, my friend. Helmut Rieger, Bob Beetle, Eileen. Hello, Eileen. Lorenzo, hello, my friends. Thank you so much for joining me today here. Thanks. Uh, all right, so what you guys will see today, I'm going to do a doodling, okay, using an iPad. And I hope that you guys will do the same way that I will do uh, later. You can do later, okay? So don't don't worry. You don't need to draw right now. Stick with me. I will give you the best tips ever so you can start to draw and learn a lot, my friends. <laughs> okay. Hopefully it's working nice. I will share my uh, view my screen. Let me show you. Let me see if it's, if you guys can see. Okay. Now, guys, uh, let me tell you. If you are on the Vectorize Club, remember you guys can try to use the new package that I've released. It's free. Why it's free? Because you can access okay the the package. And it's just awesome because you can build your your character avatar for Instagram, social medias, and this is very exclusively only for the not Patreon anymore. You know, it's not it's not Patreon. We need to say Vectorize members. <laughs> okay, we are not using Patreon anymore, as you guys know. So, and basically, you can build your character just like this, my friend. Look, I have here this one. Just show you as an example. If I change this, it's going to change everything. Look, it's going to change all of them. And we have different type of head, skin colors, and face. And it's just awesome. And you can build your version and upload on the, on the Telegram and whatever you want, my friend. It's just awesome, really. And, yeah. Another thing, look, you can import this as asset in your project, in any project that you, you, you have on there, any project. It can be a desktop or iPad. You can just do this. Look, I will just drag and drop. There you go. And then you can add, for example, hair. I can add, I will add here this hair, look, and boom. I can remove, ah, let's uh, suppose that I don't want this. I want another one, I want this. So I can drag and paste here and boom I can also change the color 
my friend look it's everything is vector that's why i love to use vector because it's simple and easy to use and you can change that's why i really love to use vector and if you draw these things you know on procreate or rev as raster to change the things is impossible you need to redraw everything from scratch and it's it's really impossible it takes a lot of time that's why one of the biggest reasons that I love to use Vector, you know that, so you can change the hair and other shape as well. So anyway, this is exclusively for the Vectorize members and you can access with the VectorizeClub.com, okay? How and where? Open the website, or this one, Vectorize, Vectorize.com, uh, VectorizeClub.com, this one, and access and get your avatar, my friend, okay? So let's get started right to the lesson, officially. Let's get started. So, um, let's see here some principles that we're gonna cover for today. So it's gonna be about, look at this, the astronaut project. And we're gonna do a very simple project, believe me. And it's gonna be about doodling. Well, do you know guys what is doodling? Tell me on the chat if you know, and if you don't know, I will explain here already. Guys, doodling is the way that you can sketch and release your creativity. Is where you can just make the things uh, like a brainstorming but for sketch think like a brainstorming when you place your ideas and the nice thing about this is that you can draw without worrying so much about the colors the details and it's just letting your ideas you know flowing it's just awesome that's why I love to work with with art as well because art I think is a freedom for my life you know and uh, before I became artist, I was programmer and I was always stressful. And when I do art, I'm always happy like I'm here with you guys. <laughs> it's just awesome. So look at this. Uh, before we start, you know, to make the vector, I need to make clear with you some points. The first one is understand the reference and study the elements that you are going to create. You need to study the, the reference. Because if you try to, you know, create the thing we, without having the idea, perhaps you, you're going to struggle, you draw a circle and then you, 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 perhaps you get stuck. Okay. And one point is, grab a, one reference is enough. One reference. Okay. Hello, Pablo Otavio, my friend. And Paul Burgess. Hello, my friend. Guys, grab a reference and pick a color. Can be a pink. This one. It's fine and then you can ask yourself which elements I can see on here when you ask yourself you start to develop the more ability to see more things how for example I can see one shape here it can be the helmet astronaut helmet I can see uh, inner inner uh, I can plan already what's gonna apply here later I can apply later oh, look another shape here inside look I mean, plenty where I'm going to vector. Also, I have here a box. And if you remember, I always like to give you this example, my friends. I have this box. And you can see, we have three sides. And here as well, it's not different because this is a, a cube. But what is the difference between this and this one is the size. Okay. But we have here the two sides. And of course, this one here, we have much more details. And in this stage, we try to optimize things. Don't, don't overwhelm yourself with details, my friend. Do the thing that I'm teaching you right now. Look, I will just paint here just to grab the idea. Look, I, I want to grab the essence of the size for now. I have this box, all right? And then inside of this box, we have just a small shadow that means the, the side. For example, you can paint here. And this is enough to tell us that these are going to be a shape that give us the sense of form we have a form on here okay without just one color you can understand as silhouette when you see a depth you can define as a form okay i hope that is very clear for you this means a lot really because for art this is how you can speed up your process and then we do have here my friends look let me show you a gesture and this gesture here is very you know tight can you see it's very tight why you can ask yourself why this gesture is tight it's because of the armor the armor here is heavy you know i don't of course it's because of the gravity i don't know but it's a limited uh let's say gesture can you see we have just this one 
and then I can make some lines to understand more how our farm is works. Can you see? This direction of the line can give us the direction of the farm. Okay, so if I hide right now the reference, what's gonna happen? I have already just a very, a very simple idea. This one here is enough to get the vector done, my friend. That's why I, I tell you, you don't need to have drawing skills to be very good at vector. Look, let me show you. You don't need, pay attention to me. Uh, you don't need to be a master of drawing in order to get the vector done. Vector is a rendering process. Grab a note and, you know, write it down there. Vector is a render process. That's why it's so important for you to not dig already into the vector stage in the first moment. No, you don't, you, you cannot do that. I suggest you, with the, all these years that I've been working as freelancing, you know, as illustrator, designer, my, the thing, thing that you need to focus on is the idea. Okay, as I told you, vector is a random process, not the beginning, it's not the beginning. Okay, and by doing what I'm teaching you right now, you improve much more your workflow. Uh, we have, we do have a lot of, of friends on here, the vectorized friends, and I can see they improving a lot with our methods. You know, following this very simple guide here that we have on the Vectorize Club as well, in more depth. You know, here I explain, of course, I do my best to explain every step where you can follow the jump principle, where we explain each step and we don't feel lost in your process. Because many people get really frustrated in their process because they don't know how to start, how to finish, how to make colors. And that's why it's so important to have a workflow, a process. Okay, no problem at all if you feel stuck in this point. No, the colors, we, we can improve this one. But it takes time, little by little, okay. Okay, and then my friend, <clears throat> let's see here. Let's get started to the vector, okay. Oh. We can, let me let me st make a stylization of this. I will translate this to a nice style, to my style, okay. I will draw here right now before I get into the vector, okay. A circle using the paintbrush for now. Oh, doodling. I'm starting to doodling. A circle. I can draw here this shape. Can you see? I can draw here this shape. I will draw just uh, a gesture. I'm making a, let's say, a cute version. I can draw here the legs. Okay. Uh, so I'm trying to draw here my idea. I'm just getting into the idea. The arms, can you see? I can draw the arms right here or on here. I can draw both on here. I can draw here above. Can you see? Can you imagine in your head? I don't know if you guys can imagine, but when you try to draw, you can imagine already where you can feel the drawing. Okay, for example, here I have the helmet in this position. Okay, and then I can draw here some, some small lines to guide me. Okay, and then on here, I can have this gesture, for example, the, the hands, the hands can be on here. Uh, can, you, can you see how many possibilities that we can do? Just having this rondo, you know, sketch. So, look, I can do many, many ways my, my thing here. So, it, it depends about the imagination that you have in your head, but for this one, I will make something. Let, let me try here to think. Oh, let me imagine more. I will draw. The, remember about the box? Remember? I will draw this, but in a more simplified way. Can you see? I can do a box very simple like this. I can do a box very, you know, uh, big as well. We can have many different versions of this box that is, you know, behind. Your job as illustrator, artist, graphic designer is to make things in a new language that only you can do. Basically, it is your job, my friend. This is how the vectorizer works. Here we give you the best tips ever. Look, I will draw this. I can be a can be a planet. He can just, for example, is jumping. Can jump here. Let me draw the box. I can do here a box. Some lines. You can see, I'm just leaving my idea working for me. I am not thinking so much at this point. I can, can draw something like this. Can you see? Later, I can add a face if I want. 
Oh, look. And I, this can be a planet. This can be here. I can add a plant here below. Oh, look. It can be a planet. Let me draw a better circle. I'm drawing. Look, with my, my shoulders. You need to practice exercise, my friend, if you want to, to draw better. <laughs> okay? So, don't draw like this. No. Don't draw like this. Draw with your shoulders. Okay? And, and your wrists. Just like that. You know, I'm not the best guy to explain how you can draw. I'm the best guy to teach you the vector process. But here is my tips to give you more, let's say, insight. Uh, it's fine here. I can add, for example, define better. When I make strong lines, it's because I'm I'm doing a better decisions. I'm I'm creating better decisions for my design. Look, here is a strong line. So this is strong line. I will not remove this. I can remove later, but if I make this strong. And it's because I like this. This one is not strong. Why? Because I'm still thinking if I will keep with this shape here. Because in this point, I can change the shape to here. Look, can you see? I can raise these feet to top or below. And that's why you cannot vector at, at you know, the first point. No. Uh, let me raise this to clean more. Okay. A paintbrush. And then I will make the feet going down. I like this. All right. I like this one. I will stick with this. And then remember, pay attention to this tip. This will change the everything that you draw right now. Okay. Pay attention. In order to draw better, try to do this exercise. Draw two circles and connect them. Can you tell me in which direction we have here? Is from bar to top or top to bottom? It depends about this angle here. Oh, can you see? This means that we have the bottom. I can see the bottom side and I cannot see the top side. Why? Because we are seeing the bottom to top, like, you know, camera, when you are watching the camera. Okay. And why this is so important if you ask me right now? Why? Because, my friend, this will define here in which direction this line will go. If I do this, it's wrong. Look, if I do this, it's wrong. Okay? Totally wrong. Leave it a like if you are enjoying this. This is an amazing lesson, my friend. We have drawing lessons for free, vector lessons for free, and just leave it a like to show your support. I will draw just like that. I have now a nice direction. And this one, I will improve this too. Oh, look. I can improve this by raising a little bit. Okay? Oh, look. I'm just defining more my idea. Can I add this line here and another one here? Oh, it's fine. Look. And drawing here this one below. I will improve more. The same the same questions. In which direction if I draw one line here, in which direction this will be applied? It's gonna be straight? No. It can be uh, like this? Neither. I'll do like this. Why? Because the direction of my, you know, this shape here, this form, is getting this in this way, okay? It's very important to understand this principle. I call this John Cylinder, Cylinder Principle. <laughs> John Cylinder Principle, my friend! Okay, and let me, let me finish here, because I'm explaining too much, I guess. I don't know if you guys like me to explain a lot, but I need to do this a bit more faster because I don't like to take your time. You know me, you know me. You know, let me try to draw more here. Oh, look. I can add a depth here, or oh, adding depth. This is, uh, can you see? I added a black, just a small shading here. I will add a little bit from here to tell me what, why I'm doing this shape right here. Because it's a depth from this one. It's giving a form. Okay. Oh, look. There we go. I'm considering if I will add eyes or not. I can add eyes here. This is a doodling. Doodling, you can do whatever you want. Okay? You can do whatever you want. Uh, we have... Look! This this little example can become a, a satellite. My friend, look at this. This will become a satellite. I don't know uh, how the satellite works. You know, from... you know, I'm drawing this from my head, my friend. So I will do this in this way. <laughs> satellite this year. This is a satellite. And 
I did it. I mean, very lovely because when I look at some shape, it can become things that I haven't ex expected. I haven't planned to do this guy here, and he he had just appeared in my front, and I'm really in love with him. Oh look, uh, let me try. Okay, uh, defining here the lines. Look at this, my friends. I'm just. Uh, let me merge. We have we we do have here. You can see the sketch. Let me blend this, rasterize together. Okay, and I add others, other things. I can add a planet, another plant here. It can be some with some textures. I can add some eyes, a mouth, and I can uh, look. This is a, a a stage where you can just enjoy, my friend. Look. Okay, uh, you can add some stars here. I'm not very good at drawing stars, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, this is my star. <laughs> so, uh, at the beginning, when I was learning, you know, when I was a kid, uh, people uh, teach you to draw a star like this. Dun, 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 dun. I think it's like that. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, look. I think it's nice. Oops. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, my friend, uh, it's fine. I like that. Let's get to the vector. Let's get with the vectorized stage. Who is excited to see the vectorized stage? Let me cut this, cut, and I will I will clean my interface here. Let me. This guy, we don't need this anymore. I hope that I'm I've been with you very clear with the things that I've been teaching you today. So let's hide this guy. I don't need this anymore. And uh, let me paste. And okay, it's here. Why I just sliced it? Because I wanted just to leave this area exclusively to this sketch. Okay, that's why I've just I cleaned it. So I will reduce the opacity. As many of you know, but some beginners are here, so I will try to, uh, you know, to explain like if you are very beginner. Okay, that's why my goal is not because you are already you know master of vector. I don't know, but I will explain like you are very beginner. Okay, so. Can you see the real difference between raster and vector is like I said is the process raster you can use at the beginning and vector you can use more to the rendering process okay and then uh, you need to be careful you need to be careful with the line art the line art I will explain better you can do the line art by using the for example the paintbrush and then you can grab oh just to give you an example okay like procreate remember you can do like procreate i'll create a pixel layer and you can do the your drawing like this okay you can do if you want like procreate no problem at all but here my goal with you is to teach you vector my friend so the vector is works only in design persona and for this one we are going to use only the pencil tool okay we, we will not use the vector brush for today for today <laughs> but no problem at all but Pencil tool, why pencil tool? Because when you draw, look at this. Pencil tool is enabled and I will draw. I have this line. And then you can decide in this line, the stroke right now, can you see? You can decide the guideline before you finish your project. Okay. And then you can decide as well the, the weight that they will have in this line. Oh, can you see? We have a, like a tapper, I think it's tapper tapering you can see if I leave just like that in this way now if I draw it's gonna have this option here that I have just adjusted okay can you see and then I can start to create the vector but I suggest you if you do this you can face, face some problems because oh, you you see you see I will start to vector this over okay now look let me adjust the size and I'll test. Let me uh, vector this first. Oh, look. It's here. Can you see? Again, the line here is small, no problem at all. But you can adjust this later if you want. Can you see? It's because it's vector, my friend. You can adjust this line art. And let's suppose that you want to close this. One way to close this, enable the scoop and redraw again. You need to do this uh, sometimes because it doesn't work properly. Let me try to do this again. Oops. Oops. 
Let's see. Let's see. Okay, it's working. Oh, yeah, my friend. Look, but again, the Node 2 is not. Uh, sorry, the Pencil 2 is not perfect. Sometimes for drawing, it creates a lot of nodes. But I like the freedom of drawing. The free drawing, I really love. But no problem at all. After that, you can click here, insert inside, and I will draw another shape that is going to be inside. Okay. And then I will draw, but in the outside i don't want to draw inside why because this one here is above you see remember it's not closed right and i will close oh, you need to try a couple of times if it is not working perfectly i will use the node tool okay just like that and in this stage we just need to draw the shapes remember shape only shape Forget the colors, details, just shapes. And now it's time to focus on here. Okay, oh, let me let me uh, keep this line flat for now, oh, straight. Okay, and then I will start the vectorize here. Boom. Boom. Ah, oh, let me just apply here. Okay. Now the planet. I don't need to explain this, this stage here because I'm just vectoring. Oh, it's not rounded, no problem at all. I can just cut this vector. <laughs> Any problem that happened, my friend, just remember, you can fix. Do not get overwhelmed, okay? You can always change. You can always change. Oh, look, it's almost ready. Not ready 100% because we need to do more things here. The planet, I will use the ellipse because I'm, I'm a bit lazy today. Boom, I have a planet. I will adjust this to more organic style. I will remove this fuel. I don't want, want to have the fuel for now. The fuel, uh, you know, thing is here. Let's do the satellite. I uh, thank you for uh, remembering me. Daniel, I will add <laughs> the face in this guy here too. Pencil tool and I will draw. Look, this is shape. You can do, uh, this is doodling, okay? This is doodling, my friend. Node two and close, it's here. Pencil tool, draw a square, and another here, and close. Node tool, close. Another one here, pencil tool. My friend, this is how the vectorize works. Here, we do things like a magic, my friend. Close. Vectorizing. Oh, repeat. Pencil tool, draw, and close. Pencil tool, draw, and close. No secret at all. There's no secret, my friend, here. Oh, look, I'll draw this. Hmm. This is doodling, okay? I can make mistakes. If you relax, you need to relax when you are making doodling. You don't need to be in over pressure. Uh, look, I will group. Remember, please, after you finish your your lines, remember to group then. Why? Because it's important. I have this group that I can move. Later, I will add details, okay? No problem at all. And then uh, select, just to make sure that, uh-huh, it's here. The planet is here. Okay, what is grouped? The astronaut is grouped, the satellite, and this planet here. And we need to do these guys as well. Mm. Let me do with the pencil tool. Why I want to do with the pencil tool? Uh, the, the idea about doodling is to make things, let's say, uh, hang around. Okay, not, it's not supposed to be perfect. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, <laughs> let me draw again. Oh my God, I love this one. It's good. Close, you can close the curve right here below, okay? Close, there you go. And then I will draw this one. Boom. Nice, I like that. Uh, you can change the direction. Remember about the direction that I told earlier. That's why my lessons always have uh, a purpose. I always have a meaning because remember about the direction if you, you see in this way it's like you are uh, looking from below you know you know and if you are seeing in this way it's like you are looking from the top and looking down okay uh, yeah my friend this is the John principle and there the, let's draw this stars here ah this star I will not draw by hand <laughs> okay I will, I'll use this shape here we have star, hopefully. 
John, ó, hashtag John don't know how to draw a star. <laughs> ah, this one here looks nice. And I want to make this more, let's say, drawing, hand drawing. How I can do this? My friend, look at this. I'm going to convert this to, to curves. Curves. Node tool. Select then all. And click here, smart. And then you make some modifications. Okay, now uh, you can do this. Oh, hand drawing. Look at this. 100% hand drawing. Nobody knows that, that I did this hack. And duplicate here. I could use symbols and add some, you know, let's say faces, but I will not do faces for the stars. It's too small to add face. Okay, there you go. Uh, for now, look the result that we got. Let me let me just group this. Uh, we have the stars. Group the stars, and then we need to group this this planet. As I said, always group your project. And there you go. I'll group them all together. And look at this, my friend. What you got here? This is our vector. Vectorize. Okay. Let me just save this. Remember, ah, just in case you are new here, if you just just join here now, you can download and get our vectorize pack only the vectorizeclub.com. Okay, and you can use and create your avatar. Thank you so much, my friend. So back on here. <clears throat> in this point. It's time to add details. When I mean details, it doesn't mean to be called. It depends about your goal. Let's keep this simple. On here, John Principal, we did already the shape and geometric. But one thing that is not a rule about this John Principal is that you can go to the lines. Can you see that we have shapes and we have lines and patterns? In this in this design that I'm creating, I'm not going to do the colors and neither values or big shadows no i will just work with shape and lines or in some patterns as well you see you see uh, first of all remember about the shape that i did here you remember oh, look this one i can make as black okay and let me back with the sketch why because this sketch i have the directions for the lines if you remember can you see now? Oh, back on the on this guy. Now I will add the lines that will represent the small details. I can do this. Look, oops, uh, pencil tool, and boom, and boom, and then you can draw more lines, and then you can define the lines right here. Look how easy it is, my friend. Okay, look how it's becoming. This is so amazing. Uh, drawing some lines here, here. Oh, I can draw here below. Uh, this division between the legs is very important. And here, okay. Uh, you don't need to have drawings. Just to relax, my friend. Look, it's very nice. I really enjoy to make art because of this. It, it's it's just you in the art. And you guys here that you know are are watching me here. <laughs> Thanks so much for your time to, you know, to take into this lesson. I really appreciate that. Ah, okay, look, I can add some details. This kind of it's very simple. It's very simple. You don't need to overwhelm. It. Oh, I have. You remember that I have a shape here. I would do that. Oh, no problem at all. I can do. It. I can also make this shape. Look at this. I can make the shape or uh, using sculpt mode and change. I can do this. All right. And then I can continue here and draw. Let me let me do this. Uh, there is a stroke here. Let me copy this color. All right. Can you see how doodling is amazing? Don't you don't, don't need to worry about details like you know color shade is no no it's just you are uh, one here one point here you want to square I'm, I'm just creating this for my mind right now look ah, I can have this one detail here one detail here okay it's just you and your imagination <laughs> this is the, the guided meditation with John for today my friend this is the guided meditation <laughs> the vectorized guided meditation so today at the night when you are going to sleep, just think about, hey, you need to 
you know, uh, keep calm and relax. <laughs> Art doesn't does need to be hard, really. Doesn't does need to be hard. Unless if you don't know how the Vectorize Club works. Oh, look. Let me just group these guys. Okay, oh, look. Group and then, you need to group is very important. Group the details. Why? Because each time when you draw, is it can become very big, you know, the project. And uh, yeah, this is my tip. And for this one, look, uh, let me create the, the line. Oh, you see, okay. I, I can increase here below, no power at all. Very simple. Boom. And I can suppose that we have a shadow here, how we can represent the shadow. In the same way that I did here, you can represent the shadow by, by doing this, look. I will draw area and click here, we use a few, all right? This is how it works, my friend. Okay, look. And then I can also, let me add more, let's see here. More lines here at the top. Okay, it's fine. Here in this one, can you see that the, the inside shape is empty? It's empty, right? I will copy the color that is here just to make this clear. Okay, just make this clear. And then I will draw this one here without the, the fill. So you, you need to pay attention to one point. Uh, when you are drawing, you need to see if you, you are having the stroke or the use the fill. It's very important, okay? Hello, Patajo. Happy. Ah, hello, Carmen. Carmen is a great friend of us. Yeah, my friend. Look, let me just create here now the face. Oh, this hands here is horrible. I need to change this. Let me, let me redraw this again. Sculpt mode, and I will try to make this in this way. Let's see. Boom, <laughs> it's fine, it's much better now. <laughs> okay. Can you see that you can always change? I will draw eyes, and I can increase the eyes. Oh, one point, and you can increase here. Look, look at this device. Look at it, it's, uh, oh, I can do this. Vectorizing. Uh, here below draw and resize draw and resize there you go but these eyes here you can see that is not oh my gosh <laughs> uh, can you see that it's different because I need to change this way and bring this one to here one advice is you can you can do this look click here at the top and expand the stroke and then this has just become a curve I mean a shape Okay, it's a shape. Why? Because now you can change like this. All right. This is the vectorizer, my friend. Oh, here you will learn a lot of things about very nice devices, art devices, vector stages, stuff that is very easy. You, I see that you are feeling very happy with this small example that I'm giving you. Comment on the chat if you are enjoying, please. It means a lot. Let me draw this line. Now, with if, add with if here. And about the face. I will add here below, here at the top. And draw the mouth. Oops, the mouth is too big. But I will resize right now. Ah, it's fine. Look, I have a nice guy here. Um, can you see that I have this shape? And I just need to fill the color with the background because, you know, I want to keep this in this way clean, very clean. The same way for this one. Why we need to use the fill? Because some lines will overlap others. For example, this one, can you see? It's overlapping because it's transparent. It's it's transparent. So you can add the color from here. And then, my friend, look. Uh, remember, this is a very nice uh, device. Uh, come to me here. I will give you the example about the difference between uh, patterns and lines. Okay, it's an art principle. How it works? Not yet. Uh, here, in the lines and patterns, this is these are responsible for the details in order to compose a visual form. Any visual form, everything, it, it works in this way. Okay. And uh, let me grab here this baby Groot. <laughs> baby Groot, come on here. This baby Groot. Can you see? We have we do have a lot of things. This can be called texture and patterns. Okay. This can be called texture and patterns. And some objects 
when we have this style of repetition you can do this look oh, you you can let's put that is a solar thing i can do this oh. boom boom oh. and then i cross here look my friend this looks like a uh biscuit is biscuit a cookies <laughs> I don't know. Okay, look, I have a pattern here. Can you see? This is a pattern. And you can also add a pattern just like that. Boom, 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 boom. Oh. Look, I have a pattern here of lines. I can add more here. And I can add something like this. At this point, I'm really doing things, you know, like, like crazy. <laughs> And this point as well, let me try to add something like this. Ah, it needs to be applied here, okay? It needs to be applied here. Hmm. There you go. Okay. Look how it's becoming. We we have a sketch b uh, below, but don't worry, we are going to remove this later. I'm just uh, using this sketch in order to see where are the position of our guys here. My God, I'm not doing great with the mouth. Look at the shape. <laughs> Let me remove it. Okay, now. Okay, my friend, look at this. This mouth is now is perfect. <laughs> okay. And then, let me remove now the sketch. Oh, look how, how, how many layers we do have here. That's why it's important to organize our product. And let me add a small background here below. Now, let me add background okay like you uh, apply this color is fine there you go ah the the pen is that is here also i need to apply the color and this one needs to be applied below why because it's very let's say above of the of the layers of the astronaut you know there you go can you see Oh, these arms as well needs to be f with the few and you see there you go and I can add some small lines here in order to have oh, you see okay some details here and let's add more details this line is actually you know, a circle here, a circle here. Yeah, look, a circle here, and another here, a circle here, here. Up to you. And this one, can you see this one? Uh, I can add a kind of highlight, but a false highlight at this stage. How you can do that? Very simple, my friend. We are almost ending. Okay, look, I'll add this. There is a stroke here, and I will grab this color. There is a, a, a curve. I will change this one. I will do this again, okay? Pencil tool, grab the same color from the background, and draw here. There we go. I can add here. Let me try. Narrow size. Like this. Boom, boom, boom. This is the vectorizer friend. And I will add more more patterns here because it's too clean i, I want to make some de detailed stuffs oh. one here here oh. can do this all right also for this one i can i can also add for example like a planet I can add like a planet can be something like this. Huh? Okay, look. Some lights are not fitting perfectly, but no, no problem at all. You can uh, vector this over and later you can adjust. And uh, this one is the same. This can be a moon. And rem remember about the patterns. The patterns can be uh, about the moon, can be something like this. Look. Oh. I'm 
I'm trying to draw this from my head at this point. Like a cheese. Can be, now we can add a face as we are doing for everything basically. We, are, we can do a big guy here, this point, to finish this. And a resize, there we go. My friend, look at this! Look, we have just finished our, our doodling. This is a new doodling that I did here with you, okay? And uh, remember, you can join the Vectorize Club website and get a lot of benefits, hundreds of benefits if you join on the Vectorize Club. You can try seven days free, okay, before, you know, you you get charged, of course. But don't worry, you can unsubscribe at any time. Okay, I hope that you guys really enjoyed this lesson. And uh, yeah, my friend, I really love this. <laughs> and tell me on the chat if you guys like it. Also, you know, you can you can add, for example, you can change the color, you can change its art style. Let's put that you you can you want to change the style. You can just add colors if you want. You can make this for example the background as black. Oh, you can make this. It's up to you. It's not uh, up to me, your creativity, my friend. I'm here to teach you my easy process where you can do the things in very few pro and not few process, but in few steps. I'm I'm give you a shortcut and it's free. I'm doing you know the the live stream here open for everybody to watch, but uh, with your support on the Vectorize Club, it's helped me a lot. You know that I'm freelancing. <laughs> I do freelancing, and yeah, I I really want to to raise a, a very nice community. We we do have already a nice and awesome community. I want to thank everybody, mainly the the not patrons but the Vectorize members. You guys are so awesome. Uh, thanks so much for trusting my work. You know, I'm I'm always happy to share with you my stuffs, but it, it's not easy at all. You know, to to bring everything here the way that I do. Really, sometimes I I, I do things here very tired, but I need to do that. You know, yeah, you you can do many stuffs. Really, you can do many stuff here. You can invert this, the colors. You can do uh, change this color because in this process here, I've just stopped it at the line art, basically just the line art. And then you can add in the way that you like. My friend, it's just awesome. Oh, I can change and uh, uh, not challenge. I can change challenge. Oh my sorry, <laughs> I can challenge everybody that works with Procreate to make these things faster than me, and always try to change the style as well. You know, it, it's just uh, it's just fast the way that we can do with Vector and change the stuffs, change the art style. If the client don't, don't like, you know, something. Uh, you can you can change, you know. It's so easy to change the stuffs. All right, and I want to thank you guys so much. Uh, tell me if you have questions before I go. Tell me, my friend, if you have questions before I go. All right, just tell me. In this meanwhile, I will look at the chat. Uh, guys, you you have been so awesome because uh, today we got a problem with my internet, <laughs> as usual. And then now we, we we are here back, you know. <clears throat> Questions, my friend? Let's see. Thank you so much, Angela, Ariadna. Really, you guys are so awesome. I don't have a lot of words to describe how thank I am. Yeah, you can think like a coloring book. I did a lot of coloring books for some clients of mine. Uh, thank you so much, Mo Moonin, Hapix, Carmen, Eileen, yeah, my friend, Damien, Damien is great, hello, my friend, Alexander Lee, yeah, guys, and yeah, just before we wrap up, you can, uh, remember, you can, ah, before I go, I, d I don't know if I show you this thing, let me show you, I did this thing, uh, as a exercise, for fun, basically, and yeah, I did on the sketchbook. Let me show you the sketchbook. Where is this thing? Just a sec, guys. Where I placed it? This? Ah, it's here. This was the sketch, and I did, you know, this one from here, from the sketch, sketchbook. A potato's head, <laughs> head, you know and a potato gun 
and just hitting the guys the food guys look at this <laughs> this is the vector for and that's why you know i like to encourage you to do my my lessons because you can do these things as well i'm sure everybody can do you know and if you tell me ah, that i'm talented that i'm good no i do because i love and i practice a lot that's why i you know i feel great with the things that i do because i practice a lot if you practice you will get better okay guys i think that's all really that's all for now i don't want to take a lot of time um uh, see you uh, next time okay and the next week we're gonna do another lesson of course we're gonna keep doing lessons every week i will try hard really and to build a very nice community with you guys all right see you my friends bye 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 <laughs>